Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to the channel. We are in Chalice, Idaho, small mountain town tucked away here in the Bora mountain range. In the film coming up, there's actually like three segments. The first two, we encounter some precarious situation. One was I got myself up into uh, this mountains, this small little mountain road and uh, the RV just could not handle that thing. And so I had to find a way to turn that around. And that was really a hairy situation, but we made it out, obviously, we're, I'm sitting here. The other was on Interstate 90, headed west from Lolo National Forest. To get to Chalice, we encountered this incredible wind rainstorm with 45 mile an hour gusts, and it was raining to beat the band. But across the state line from Mon Montana to Idaho, we got the incredible opportunity to travel the beautiful scenic Salmon River to Chalice. And you are going to be right there in the cab with us every mile of the way. And thank you very much. Don't forget to subscribe and watch this video to the end. Very beautiful scenic drive on the Salmon River in Idaho. There's a one mile of five to six. Then there's three and a half miles of six. It gets more narrow. And then it's five. And then, is that doable? Which one? Sixth grade? Oh, we can do a six. Oh. Well, this is way off the beaten path. We're way off the beaten path. <laughs> we don't normally we'll see what we get. I don't know what we're going to get into. We'll see. I don't know. We got on this, this little road. I don't know <laughs> what we got here. We'll see. We're on this little road. I'm going to see if I can find a place to turn around. This is a. Uh, I'm gonna turn around. This is a too uh, too hard on the RV. Too steep. Too hard. Not being first gear. You can get up this thing. Good. Going 30 miles an hour. Working too hard. I'll get off of it when I can. Okay, we're gonna turn around here. I'll be going down on the muddy side. Tricky. This is tricky. We gotta turn around. This little road is way too steep for this 22,000 pound machine. Don't stop. I'm trying not to get stuck. I just elected to go to take the turn from pavement to the muddy instead of muddy to the pavement. You're clear. I think we made it. Wait a minute. Hallelujah. All right. Good. We may not get there till tomorrow, but we yeah. won't be on this road. Uh, That's okay. We're going to go back to the interstate. I'm glad. Go ahead and turn around. It's, this is a true mountain road. Way too hard. I'm in first gear. Second gear. Whoa. Way too hard. People are probably like, those folks are lost. What'd you say? <laughs> People are probably like, those folks are lost. Oh, they think we're crazy, man. Just might be. But this is an absolutely true mountain road. It'll be all right. Eight miles to the uh, good road. Oh boy, what an adventure. I don't mind. Oh, that's so pretty. Yeah. It's just, that's beautiful. It's very beautiful. It's just too hard on the transmission and the uh, engine to uh, keep traveling this road. It's good enough. It's pretty rough. We just saw a sign back there that said rough road. Let's go down here. Oh boy. There's no place for a class A. Big rig RV. Oh my goodness. Oops, I'm sorry. Right in the middle of nowhere. Well, that's where we spend our life. <laughs> we spend most of our time in the middle of nowhere. We like it there. That would get us nowhere. Oh, right. Yeah, right. It's a little smoother now. The distance is shorter, but. Yeah, it isn't shorter? The distance was shorter. Oh. But it, I'm glad we're not doing it. I see. Time wise, it's not. We'll just take our time and enjoy of course. the day. Yes. Dude's all worried about it. He's happy now. He's happy. He was constantly patting me going up. He wasn't digging that. Man. Scooter right. was praying that got it. That was rough. Pretty rough. I'm coming, buddy. I'm coming back. Whoa. Pretty. That's pretty. We abandoned that route. We're going to go back to Interstate 90. And take 90 to west of Missoula, Missoula, however it's pronounced. And then we'll go south to Chalice. <laughs> we're 
That's the name of it. Chalice. Chalice, Idaho. Which we're going to stay a week there. It's a very beautiful place. Pretty out there. It's some kind of a grassland spin area. This is Beaverhead Deer Lodge Flint Creek Range National Forest. Oh, true. There's no forest, but that's what they call it. That was 90. At the stop sign, turn left onto South Frontage Road. I guess I better slow down here. You're going to go straight on to the interstate. <laughs> Get the frontage road. <laughs> okay. Left. Left, she said. All right, left we'll go. Clear right. All right. Here we go. All right. The next turn right. Too cool. We're going into rain. Going into the rain. Yeah, I can see it. I'd rather do rain there than down in too cool. It's still cold up here. It's like 59 degrees. And it's noon. And then you're going to go left to get on the interstate. Okay. Right at the stop sign. Oh, there's the wanky wanky. There's the hospital for you right there. The Say what? State hospital. If Maybe you... that's where I need to go. <laughs> you think you need okay, some? Okay, I don't know what these guys are doing. They're out in the middle of the road. I think they're working. Yeah, they're working. There's their equipment right there. Yeah. Turn left to merge onto I-90 West. All right. Snitter cooter. All right, okay. All right. Take this to Missoula. We are on Interstate 98 West, 96 miles to Missoula. Picked up a little rain here, nothing to write home about. Looks like we can get, get into it. I think I'll slow down a little bit. Missoula, 81 miles. Yeah, I got a wind advisor. That is blowing me all over the road. I'm going to slow down even more. Up to 45 miles an hour. 45? Up to 45. Oh, Lordy, up to 45. No, we're going to slow down. Quite a bit. It's pushing me all over the road. Oh, wow. Whoa, whoa. I found a place to pull off my wheel. Oh, boy. Wow. Wow. Oh, man. It's dangerous, actually. You didn't know about this. We're going 45 right now. You see how windy it's blowing it from uh, south to north. It looks like it could be all right. We've been in worse. Well, it let up. Nice. It let up. A nice. Oh. We're halfway to Missoula. Think about it. We're always halfway to somewhere. 41 miles. 41. See, I can stand on my ears. It was cold this morning. The 3rd of June. Old Billy Joe Day. Going in the down side of the pillow. This looks good. Wind settled down, the rain stopped, all boats. Keep coming. Look at these formations over here. Cathedrals. Look like some sun over there. What's that? Looks like some sun over there. It's clear. What's that? What's that? <laughs> what you say? Watch that. What's that? Oh yeah. I know what you mean. Scooter, lay down, take a nappy. Come on, baby, lay down, take a nappy. Look on this side, and look over here. South 
of Missoula. Is where are we staying tonight? National Forest? Yes. Yeah. Down there. On the way to Chalice, Idaho. There's actually snow over there too. It's snowing. Oh, is it? In those mountains. If you look at the weather, wow. it's we're on the road right between two weather systems and it's wow. snowing. Up in the mountains. Way up in the mountains. Nice. We don't have any room on this road. We don't have any jerk around move. You don't have what? Any jerking around. No, I like that. You go jerk around and have some room to do it. I mean, they got to pop sunlight up to this place. That's the bit of root river. Man, we are in the mountains. These country folks live here. I bet they get up 4 o'clock in the morning. To do what? That one was closed. This is all closed in the wintertime. There was something with trees out there. Some disease or something they're trying to control. Oh, yeah. Look at this set up. Set this up. Pardon me? I said, Who set this up? You said, Look at this setup. This reminds me of Utah. One of the drives we did in Utah. Oh, you're right. Almost What's the temperature anyway? Let's see what they say. Your altitude there. 43 out. degrees. Pardon me? 4 43. It's 43 degrees. And going down to 33. We're gonna need some heat tonight. Now look, it's four o'clock in the afternoon. Uh oh. June the third. Snow tomorrow. It's chilly <laughs> up here. Oh boy. We're almost to Idaho. Yeah, we'll see you People up here, I I guarantee you they're grizzly bear. They're watching us right now. Boy, they are big and they are fast. They run 30 miles an hour. That's the town. <laughs> this is the town, yeah. Sula. S U L A. What about that? This might wake up the snow tonight. Almost there, buddy. No. Somebody what what is that? That's something I don't know. What is snow? It might snow here tonight. Oh boy. 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 Oh Somewhere, somewhere, chain up. But we may be going over that pass. Permit? We'll see. Nice. It's up here on the right, Camp Camp two, 729 Road. Uh, National Forest Camp, right up here. Right up here. Ooh, baby. There it is. Here we are. I'm going to get out and get that little sticker, that little envelope. You gotta get out what? Get that envelope before we depart. The envelope, you gotta go a half a mile. You gotta do what? Half a mile. Half a mile. One mile. We yep. have conflicting information here. We gotta go back, back in here. Might be some bears back in yeah. here. Or some woo pig silly. Squeal like a pig. Keep your eyes open for a while, Rod. Right? Yeah, soon. Up here, you're gonna take a ride on. Camp to 729 Road again. Did you reserve the spot already? No. Oh, first come, first serve. It didn't look like I needed to. And it's a lot cheaper if you just pay there. That's a resort. Two miles? Oh, point two. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Point two, that's fine. I doubt it's filled up. I doubt it too. <laughs> Man, this is really isolated. Just around the corner. Uh, well, we got the gate. The destination is on the left Indian train. 10 miles an hour, I don't think so. A quarter of a mile. Another quarter? Not quite a mile. Right over there, I want to get out and get the uh, pamphlet yeah. to pay. Yeah, post, yep. Instead of having to walk back. Oh, absolutely. Same deal, 750. Wait right here, Scooter. See if we can find a pull through. You got the envelope. Yay. We'll drop our money off in the morning when we uh river. It's really tight. We need to pull through. Left, Indian trees camp ground. We can't back in. Here's, Here's one. one. We're home for the night. You can see we're definitely in the in the forest. I'm gonna go up a couple hundred feet here. That'll be good about right there. 
and we'll swing around and let you see where we are here. We are deep in the forest here in Montana on our way to Idaho, Chalice, Idaho. We'll be staying there for a week, but look at this. Anyway, this is it. This is this particular national forest. I'll have to uh, just show you. I just want to show you. Let me do a uh, downward uh, view here. We'll spin around. It's very beautiful. It's for the uh, people who uh, love quietness. Very quiet. No trains, no planes. That's it. I just wanted you to see it. We'll get landed and make our way to Chalice. Well, that was fun. What's the name of this, uh, this park? Indian Reservation or something? Oh, no. Some tribe lived here. Hmm. Tribes. We are up in the mountains. We're climbing, that's for sure. We've got some serious climbing ahead of us coming up right here. We'll have to give it some juice I get around this corner. Windy road up in the mountains. Say again? We're almost up to the snow. We are. There you go. We are up top of the world. We're way, way up. Still climb. We got a lot to climb. Uh, let's get to it. This is a heck of a drive. There's a ski slope over there. Oh, yeah, a lot of them. Here's the fence. I bet you have. I think it's a four. That's right. Four. We checked in there on the third. Chalos. That's where we're going. Oh, what a... Welcome to Idaho. Hey, we're Yay. in Idaho. Ha, ha. Stickers all over it. <laughs> Idaho, y'all. Here we are, Cookie. You're in Idaho. Oh, now we're going down. Five miles. Five grade. Five miles, five grade. We're going down in second gear. Did you like that coming up? This is the second gear. And this was the pass we had to do. This was the pass. This is the pass we had to deal with. That's it. To get exactly. to Chalice. That's true. Idaho is beautiful. Love Idaho. Look at that. Oh, Lordy, look at that. That's way up there. There we go. Take it easy. 6% descent. Something you see in the movies. We have to go quite slow. Around this curve. We do. We love Idaho. Three more miles. 5%. We take it easy. Did the snow last night? Uh, Indian trees. It probably did. It probably did. At the higher did. altitudes here. <laughs> you think it did? Well, at the higher altitudes, maybe. <laughs> oh, it could have where we were, but I didn't see it. Got down to 39. We had a propane heater all night. It was cozy. We were cozy, weren't we, sir? We kept us cozy. Yeah. Snuggled up in bed there and cover up. We're in the true wilderness of Idaho. We're following the Salmon River. This is just incredible. This kind of thing I'd see in the movies when I was a kid. I didn't think I'd ever see anything like this. We had to live long enough to discover it, to explore it. And we love Idaho. Well, I guess we're down out of the mountains. We've been coasting. Big game ahead. Big game ahead. Let's see, my we, phone ready to shoot. let's see if we can catch any wildlife. We are in the wilderness with a capital W. That's the Salmon River right over there to the right. Let's take it slow see if we can find something. Oh, yes, indeed. Let's face it, that's what we really want to see. All right. Look at the firewood oh, they have. I'm telling you. My goodness. <laughs> they got so much firewood. Sweet. But it gets cold. You died without it. These are cabins. These are not traditional homes up here. Horses. Horses. And a mule. Mules and horses. Mules. More horses. They have quite a few mules up here. They said a, that said a hundred acre wood. Is that it? That's what it said, a hundred acre wood. Remember that? That reminds me of Tennessee. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Beautiful country. Imagine living here. What's that? Oh, bicycles. It's not artificial intelligence. This is real. Absolutely real. Yeah, Lewis and Clark was here. They were everywhere. Any waterway big enough. That's what they were looking for is a waterway to the north. 
much west. One of the things. 20 miles to go. Turn in 21 miles. All right, cool. BLM. Ha ha. We. No charge. Stay a couple of weeks. That's what we were seeing those campus. Beats the last one, or each curve. 